What's up, guys? guys? Guys, we are on our way to the beach right now, but we had to make a quick pit stop pit to get some sunscreen. sunscreen. We don't want to burn. We got some pasty skin. But, guys, stay tuned for the end of the video, guys, because we're going to be telling you guys probably one of the most insane, crazy, unlucky, funny <laughs> stories ever. ever. So, make sure you guys stay tuned. Uh, we got a crazy one for you guys today. <laughs> I'm going to get the sunscreen, but first, I have to throw away Juice's shaft because he pooped right before we were leaving. And so we just brought it in the car and it smelled so bad. Like the whole drive here was so freaking disgusting. But we need to get sunscreen because Hunter and I burn so easily. We're very pasty white. But yeah, I'm gonna bring you guys and you guys are not ready for this video. When I tell you the thing that happened to Hunter is insane and we actually have a bunch of clips from when it happened that we're gonna put in throughout this video too. So stay ready. <laughs> Juice was doing this thing where he was like looking for mommy. Yeah, it was so funny. Look at I got good the stuff. The entire time, bro. Look at this. I got good stuff. Nice, man. Nice. Ultra sheer. It was on sale. Three bucks off. I'm a bargain. So what? It was 20 instead of 23? No, it was eight. Nice. For Neutrogena. Neutrogena. Oh my gosh, Down Juice. Down from Aussie, Australia. Juice. Are you so excited for the beach? He was doing his thing the whole time. <laughs> Just got to the beach where this all happened. I'm gonna tell them kind of the gist of what happened and what we're gonna be talking about. PTSD. PTSD inbound. inbound. Tell them what happened to Guys, you. Guys, this is the beach where I had my balls and my wiener stung by a jellyfish. <laughs> Guys. The most excruciating, horrifying, intense pain of my entire life. It was horrible. I'm not even being dramatic. It was. This is where it all went down. A beautiful, blue, sunny, calm beach day until it literally took a turn for the absolute worst. So we were just like playing fetch with Juice and Hunter was skimboarding and Juice ran over to this couple with these dogs and he peed on the man's foot. Literally took a piss right on him. He literally just peed on his foot. I'm so embarrassed. All right, so it was approximately two weeks ago in this exact spot. Just like we came to the beach with Juice, we wanted to just play. We thought it was a normal beach day. We were just trying to wear Juice out and this lady comes up to us and tells us to watch out for the blue jellyfish because she didn't want Juice to eat them because they were poisonous and they could potentially kill him. You know what's even crazy is we actually just bumped into that same lady like five minutes ago. The same exact <laughs> one vu. in the same spot right here. Yeah. So. I'm on the lookout like, okay, I'm gonna not let Juice like go anywhere near these jellyfish, you know, like not thinking anything they about like my safety, though. you know, I'm just like being a macho man and being like, shh, shh, jellyfish, like what? Yeah. We're having a great time just like playing fetch with Juice back and forth and I decide I'm gonna cool off, take a little dip, you know, I'm wearing clothes, I have swim trunks on and I'm like, hey babe, can you record me jumping in the water? I want to like post it on Instagram, you know, just a little like dive into the ocean, you know, being cool. Who needs ready? Come on, come on. And I like start like 20 feet and I just go like full sprint and just dive in the ocean. I was two steps from taking off to dive right into the ocean and I saw this blue jellyfish right where I was about to jump. <laughs> And at that point, it was too late. I had to just release, and I jumped. I belly flopped right on him. And at the time, I didn't think anything of it. But when I stood up, I was like, if you'll see in the video, it was like a delayed response where I was like, oh, And I stood up and I saw this thing right here on my stomach. And I, it was like, it sucked on me. And then I pull my pants out and I see blue ink and tentacles all over my wiener and my balls, guys. And you panicked. He started screaming. I freaked out. I was starting to feel this like burning sensation immediately. And 
he took his pants off in front of everybody. And now that I know Hunter's like kind of okay, guys, there's these blue jellyfish all over the beach and Hunter just got stung on the tip of his wiener. It hurts so bad. I stood up and the jellyfish was in my pants, <laughs> like literally right here and then he got my wiener. <laughs> it's not funny. Oh, no. Is it still in here? There were people all on the beach, and I literally started panicking, freaking out, and I stripped my pants off, butt naked, ran back into the water, and I tried to rinse them off, but it was too late at that point. <laughs> Worst part was, he stung me right on the tip of my wee-wee, <laughs> which is, if you're not a guy, Super it's sensitive. the most sensitive part of your body, <laughs> right on the head, and it, <laughs> and I didn't know at that point that he had actually got on my balls too yeah. i think his initial sting was like on my like waistline and then he slid down and got my head of my wee wee and then like at that point he was just in my pants do you see i have blue all over me those are the poisonous ones too somehow when i dove in he got stuck in my pants he, like, slid and down. i had like the netting swim trunks so which are the like, absolute stuck worst in it. and it was just like corralled in my junk. And okay, guys, my perspective is I'm just watching him like scream. So then I like stop recording and I run to him and I'm taking an, an ice cold like water bottle and start like pouring it down his pants. And then you are like, pack up, pack up, we gotta go. And then we get in the car and we start driving, okay? He never drives. She is a passenger princess to the max. Yeah, I am. But this time I was like, babe, I'm sorry, you have to drive. I can't. I'm in so much pain right now. Like, I am, have the nauseous feeling in my stomach because you're in so much pain. He was like, not okay. My balls and my wiener are burning so bad. Oh my God. It's like on fire. Moaning. I thought I was going to throw up from the pain. I was like, you got to drive. So I sat in the passenger seat and I'm like, you have to just haul it back home. I did not know what to do at that point. I didn't even think about going to the ER for some reason. Everybody always asked me that, but I was like, <laughs> just get me home. I knew hot water would help. I looked that up. Cause I looked that up. Apparently I was like the internet told us that. Okay. And the thing that was so funny is we're like halfway home. Hunter's like screaming, like, Oh, like swearing, making noises that I've never heard. And he my literally looks before. at me and he's like, pull over. I'm like, pull over. And he's like, pull over. So he gets out and runs to the freaking beach, like down maybe a mile from where it happened, we jumps it in far. and he's trying to like rinse it off. Again. Because at that point, I had like taken my swim trunks off, so I'm, butt naked. I'm sitting butt naked in the car. I have my bucket hat covering so no cars driving by can see. Hopefully, I don't think I can get in trouble for like nudity now. No, you can't. But he couldn't help it. He I, was... I take my pants off and I'm looking around because I have my big bottle of water and I'm like spraying my junk, As trying to rinse driving, it off. He, in his car, he just didn't care. And I point. see there's still blue ink and tentacles all over my sack. <laughs> and I was like, pull this car over. I have to like get this off me or the burn's not gonna go away. Okay guys, we're taking a little break from the story. We went and got $5 sushi. Let me show you guys what we got. We got spicy tuna and then we got some spicy salmon and then Hunter is inside ordering us some acai bowls and then we'll continue with the story. It's about to get crazy. I felt so bad for Hunter, but it's a memory that we'll never forget and will forever be haunted by these blue jellyfish. Okay guys, I'm gonna try to find, okay yeah, this is what stung Hunter. That is what landed on his wiener. Oh my gosh, so bad. I literally had to run out in front of all these families with basically my swim trunks at my knees <laughs> as I'm like running into the water to like splash off and try to clean off all these blue tentacles on my sack. And let me be honest, like guys, I had to literally bite my tongue because I was so freaking close to laughing. <laughs> she told me that after that she was like so close to busting out laughing, but when I tell you guys this is the most excruciating pain I've ever had in my life, like I'm sure I look super funny. Just picture me sitting passenger princess in the car while Libby's driving, no clothes on whatsoever, a bucket size. hat covering up my junk down there while I'm just making these like... It was the sounds that made me want to laugh. Like they were like, I can't even describe the sound. We had like a 30 minute ride home. 30 minutes of me in this pain 
sitting in the car, no clothes on, just sulking in my burning wee wee and balls. So once Hunter jumped in the water, he got back in the car, we skirted back home, and actually Hunter watched like his favorite thing on YouTube because I told him to, to help distract you because you were in so much pain. I had to distract my mind somehow. Because he was like freaking out. I like, oh my god, I couldn't even think straight, I was in so much pain. But he literally runs in to right here into our bathroom, he goes in the tub, turns it blazing hot. I actually had to wash juice, didn't I? Didn't he throw up? Yeah, he threw up in the back seat to top things off. That so happens you, a lot. You didn't even park. You literally dropped me off. I ran into our house, yeah. and then you went straight to like the little wash station. So then I come back and like look at Hunter just like laying in the water, like. <sighs> All right, guys. I literally sat in the shower for like an hour. I literally just stood there with the water on my junk because it took away the burn that was the only way to take away like the sting and the burn of it and then as soon as i would move it out of the water it would like be excruciating burn again so then i was like okay i'm just gonna like fill up the bathtub so as i was sitting in the shower or standing there yeah. i let the water fill up and then when you eventually made it back i was like sitting there laying in the tub and so i literally sat there in the shower slash bath for like, like Two on. hours. Yeah. I ended up making him lunch and actually bringing him a sandwich. Like in the I'm tub. sitting here in this tub that you're looking at for a couple hours. Yeah. Libby brought me, I think you made me like a, a really delicious avocado sandwich. lunch meat sandwich. It was so good. I ate my lunch right there in some trail mix. And then eventually went out to the table, the chair out there. Remember that? Oh, that was after like the burn started to like kind of uh -huh. die down a little bit. But it wasn't until like Three days later? Yeah, I would literally get like the second day two and three, I would get random like shoots of burningness in the tip of my wee wee. It was so freaking crazy. I don't want to like, people were like commenting like. Yeah, because we posted um, TikToks. We made a TikTok. A couple. Guys, the unthinkable happened today at the beach. What seemed like the perfect beach day was about to change. Yes, and but people, people were, like, were people. Do you have kids? Like, did you go to the hospital? And actually, that was the first thing I said. You'll see it in the video. You can have kids, baby. Oh, is what if I can't have kids? Because yeah. it stung down there, and I don't know if any of you guys know. Comment down below if you have any information because I actually look he am worried. <laughs> like, is that gonna affect any of my natural ability to get? Pregnant, yeah, pregnant. any of that stuff. Comment the word jellyfish if you guys did make it to the end of the video and please drop a like on the video, For guys. <laughs> I really hope you enjoyed this story. It was a very painful one, but we wanted to share with you guys because we haven't told our YouTube fam yet. So crazy. We love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and uh, watch out for them jellyfish. <laughs> we'll see you in the next video. Peace. Peace.